Hi, my name is Steve Faulkner. Welcome to Real Magic Review, and this is Catch. Before we do that, can you please like, subscribe, check out Car Magic Course because it's really, really super good. But again, as I always say, I would say that I made it. It's mine. Uh, so, so don't trust me. Go and have a look at the page. Go and have a look at the testimonials. Talk to members. Ask people on the community and in the forums. And I'll tell you how good it is, probably, hopefully. Uh, but you know what I mean. Have a look at it. It's great. Uh, loads of videos, weekly sessions, live sessions, and uh, etc. And share it. Yeah, that's it. Um, share it. And I did have one more thing to say. Uh, yeah, and by the way, I know you just don't want to willy-nilly share this on your communities for no reason. But if you, what I'm saying is if you know someone who would like it, um, God, can't get my words out today again, uh, tell them about it. Be nice, wouldn't it? Uh, at your magic club and things like that. Now we can all sort of meet up again. Uh, and one more thing, as I said, I was going to say, I did an interview with Craig Petty for Magic TV. Thank you so much, Craig. Um, have a look at that. I'll put the link below. But, but I can't watch it because I can't watch myself. I'll never watch it. But you can and tell me what you think. Because uh, there's been some lovely, uh, lovely comments on there. So that was nice. Uh, so let's get on with this. I, the catch, I am really surprised at this. And I'll tell you why. I picked this up at Blackpool year and a half ago now the last blackboard which is ridiculous they had a pre um obviously at conventions you get stuff before it gets released then obviously covid happened loads of stuff didn't get released and i looked at it and i didn't look at the download and i kind of went nah I, like i'd seen george make it look really good and i thought it's not really it's going to be really difficult really impractical um and i kind of put it away and then i thought it was going to be released so i sort of begrudgingly got out again and i'd look at it uh, and within minutes, I was having a lovely time, everyone. That's what I was doing. I'm just making sure I'm in shot. Yes, I am. Um, it was uh, last night, so I started playing with this just last night. So you saw what happened just, just at the beginning of this. And, um, and it's deceptively easy. That's one thing I will say. So what this is, it's a coin vanish. Now, many people can do coin vanish. It's almost a slightless coin vanish, really. It's not a knackless coin magic, uh, coin vanish. It's a slightless one. Uh, so it requires skill and it requires practice, but I think a lot less than learning a decent... Well, actually, I know a lot less than learning a decent coin vanish because I've done both of them. One of them was a lot quicker, that one. It's a way of completely vanishing a coin. So, you know, it's the thing that when we learn coin vanish, we always go, how can we do a complete vanish? It's kind of like all the, the, the loveliest thing to do is be able to show two hands empty. And I've looked at this with, with the ghost download, which was wonderful. And loads of ways of doing it and but like i said this one is is a kind of easy way of doing it and it and it ends super clean uh and that's kind of what it is it's a gimmick and it's a great little gimmick and there's a lot more to it than you think so it does more than you think so it's got this locking system which may, i'm not going to go into what, what it exactly does but what that means is you can reproduce it or not at will and that's really, really clever. It's not mechanical. It's not nothing that's going to break or anything like that. It's a very solid little thing, this, and it's going to last you a long time. And if one part of it does break, it's going to be very, very, very quick and simple to fix. And I don't think it will, to be honest. Uh, and, and I'm just trying to think that it's kind of an easy and a difficult thing to review because I don't want to give away what it is. What I will say is the one, the, 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 let's just do upsides to this, right? Upside is a complete vanish of a coin. It is super fun. The download is really good. It's not just a vanish of a coin. You can see how it fits into different things. So he's got a really nice sign coin to pocket, which is wonderful. You know, they sign a coin, you hold it in your hand, you open your hand, it's gone, and it arrives, arrives in the pocket, a sign coin, which is brilliant. And you do show your hands properly empty. I don't mean you should go over the top and sort of, you know, you know the thing with thumb tips that people do, they vanish it and then go, look, <laughs> it's, not, it's not like that. But, um, but you show your hands empty and then seconds later the, the sign coins back in your pocket or in your hand so is that there's a lovely coin in glass and you, it is one of those things where once you get it once you realize that you can close your hand and the coin is going to be gone there's loads of things you can do with it it's a, thankfully uh, thankfully 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 that's the right one isn't it um george does the download and it's like for uh, half an hour or something like that it's not an hour and a half of filler and in that he packs in a lot there's everything you need going from really how to use it really clearly right up to all those different things the reproduction is really cool i'll try and do it now i don't know if i can but the reproduction is just oh no i haven't got it <laughs> i just look like i haven't got it set up hang on 
That was quite funny. I hadn't had it set up. So don't do that. Don't go to a gig and go, look, what's that? And do that magical grabbing something out of the air and not being anything there. That's not going to impress anyone. Let's try and do it now. Okay. There we go. So you show, um, you grab a coin out of the air like that. You probably just did it really badly then. Because, but, you know, this is all from yesterday. And I've done pretty much everything on there. Um, yeah, I do work with coins, but I didn't feel like anything was that difficult. And you are going to feel that. You're going to feel like it's... It's, oh, it's really hard, but it's actually not when you feel it. And he has got a contingency. He's got a way of doing it which doesn't require, which requires even less skill, which I think is just as good, actually, because don't forget you can use misdirection. You don't have to go look at the coin that's gone. You, you can look at it, you can say something. There's loads of potential in this. And he's got a really lovely way of um, vanishing it, which does take that heat off, actually. It does kind of, you know, he's, he, you sort of vanish it as you're explaining what you're going to do, basically. So you've got, again, you've got time and contingency and things like that. Uh, loads of stuff on there. I think it's really good. I'm really, really, really happy to say that. The one big drawback, if you think would be angles. Now, of course, angles are a big drawback with everything like this, but I think in most situations, you know, step back a bit, you're going to be totally fine. Um, and the, you, I've been, it, this is okay to say this, apparently you do need to be wearing a watch. Okay. I've, I've asked and, and that's okay. And I think it's, it's important that you know that because up to a couple of years ago, I didn't wear a watch. And I would also say that if you've got a very light watch strap, um, it's probably not going to matter as much as you think it is, but you're just going to have to be a little bit more mindful. And that's the way it is. But other than that, it's, they're not looking at the thing anyway. So, you know, they're looking in your hand, it's gone, and they can see, you know, it's a sleeveless thing. So it's, it's got all that going for it. Um, it's great fun. I really, really like it. Um, I probably will use it. I, was, I really wanted to get some footage of me performing it, but it's just not there yet. I think it's, I'm, I'm missing about every few goes and I'd just rather um, have it solid. So you never know. If I get it sorted, I might get some footage. But, you know, you just saw kind of what it does. Um, this is really important. The, the thing I did at the beginning, that vanish, and the one you would have seen on social media uh, is does require is the only thing that you can't do out of the box everything else is out of the box you don't have to set anything up but this is something that requires you to do a bit of a setup and when uh, he said this is what you're going to be waiting for and it's like yeah yeah this sort of vanished that too good to be true vanish and then he said how you do it and part of me kind of went oh, right but then i timed it on purpose because it's important this because i kind of went oh i can't be bothered i'm not going to bother doing that and then i went actually no you've got the stuff that you need and you do need something else and it's not something expensive, but you do need it. I got that out of the cupboard and I put my stopwatch on. And uh, it was three minutes, I was, I was ready to go. Three minutes set up, ready to go. That version of it, yes, you can do it live, definitely. Um, but it, it, he, like he said, it is kind of for video. Uh, the other things about this are the... And um, that's not difficult, by the way. That's kind of the easiest thing to do out of all of them uh, with, with the thing I just did. Um, you, this isn't for half dollars. So for those things that, you know, he does a lovely thing where two coins across where you just show one coin there, it's gone and it arrives in that hand or the other way around or it vanishes from that hand, arrives in that hand. I suppose you can do both, but the latter would be better. Um, with 10 P's, this is for small sort of pocket change, borrowing money off people, etc. It's really not for your half dollars and stuff. It doesn't fit. And part of me was disappointed with that. And I thought that's the concession, you know, that's what you've got. You've, it's that one of those quick things you do with your friends or you do it at a gig, you've got 10p, bang, or a quarter, um, or a 50 cent, I think, fits a euro 50 cent, and that's what you do it for. But it isn't good for your half dollars. So if you're doing a free fly and things like that with dollars and half dollars, it's not going to work. And, you know, uh, fine with me. And, you know, everything's, everything's got, a, got a concession to make, hasn't it? And, and that's with magic, and that's this one. Uh, but I really like it. It's great fun. Uh, you can tell that George really likes it genuinely when he's doing it. He's put the work in, you know, he's really, really good at this. But don't be disheartened. I think you'll get this a lot quicker than you think you will. So um, that's Catch. Uh, all the links will be below. Thanks to Vanish Link for giving me this a year and a half ago. I'm glad it finally came out. Uh, any questions you've got, do ask me and I'll do, we'll address it on one of the live shows. The live shows are currently Thursdays. They were Mondays and Thursdays, but then I realised I've got to do stuff in life and clean the house and stuff and have the kids and everything um so it's every thursday at five if you've got any sort of questions you come along and ask them live and i will answer them and like and subscribe check out car magic course and have a great one take care bye, -bye.